what was your thoughts about the Ravens' performance? Um, I watched it at home and uh, had a chance to, to, to look at it and look at it closely. And certainly very impressed with uh, the way the Ravens played. They, they played tough, uh, it was sound, they had a lot of energy and enthusiasm and, um, and really controlled the line of scrimmage. Do you take more from what they've done recently in the playoffs than you did from their, their meeting that you had face-to-face? -face, or do you balance the two in some way? Um, well, you know, teams changed quite a bit. It was seven weeks ago, I think, somewhere around that area when we played them. So, um, you know, obviously there's an opportunity there for everyone to, to, to get better along the way. And, uh, and I think in this particular case, without question, they, they have. And, uh, and they did a, a great job yesterday, demonstrating that. In, in what ways are they a different team? In what ways maybe are you guys a different team? Well, I, I think when you, you look at it, um, Overall, I'm not certain that there's a, a huge difference. It's better, I think. I think they're running the ball better than they ever have. Uh, I think their defense is, is certainly playing that smothering style that they typically do. Um, and, uh, and, and, and playing it, obviously, I, I think, at, at an even higher level. Uh, and I think the kicking game is good and solid. Um, you know, obviously, for, for us, it is one of those things where, I mean, week in and week out, we had an opportunity. We kept getting better. And you have to judge it a little bit by what we did last week. Our practices were spirited. Our practices were were, were fast and uh, and our execution was good. So uh, you know, I, I think in both cases you're going to find both teams have uh, have made uh, tremendous strides since uh, the seven week or seven weeks ago when we played. Is there anything that Adam Benatari can do this week or the coming weeks to get himself back into mm -hmm. that that spot, or have you decided? To just go like we stated, that? like we stated last week, um, it was just kind of the, you know the way it is, and that's how we finished it. And, and our point was, you know, from what we stated it on through that Star Wars going to be kicking for us, and uh, that's it, unless there was some injury or something of that nature that may occur. Tony used to always say that sometimes playoff games are more lost than won, and turnovers lead to that kind of thing. Is this a team that you have to be even more aware of that? I, I think so. Uh, I think that's uh, kind of the way it is, really, when you look at the entire year. Typically, that, that indeed does happen, but more so even in the playoffs because. I, I think those things are accentuated quite a bit. I think if you look at the couple games that we saw here over the weekend, uh, those turnovers were, were huge. And if you can just make certain that you, you don't beat yourself, uh, obviously your, your, your chances are going to be pretty good. Any comments on, on Peyton being the uh, four-time MVP? Yeah, I, I just think it's, um, you know, what an honor. And, uh, this is a league that's so highly competitive, so many great players. Um, and uh, for a guy to, to be able to perform as well as he's performed year in and year out and um, receive that award, that recognition, four times is it, it, quite, uh, um, it, you know, quite an accomplishment. And particularly when you look at the, the great years that he's had uh, prior to this one. Um, it, some of those years you'd look at and say they, those would be tough to, to surpass, uh, but yet he finds a way to do it every, every year. And the great thing about it, you know, it's great to see a guy who works so hard, who's dedicated, who's a true professional, uh, get that kind of recognition. But the great thing also is the fact that today, even right now, he's trying to get better uh, at this moment, you know, looking at our opponent, uh, making certain that he knows all the ins and outs about them, trying to find a way to get an edge.